Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say, if you like this content, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want a video of your own, make sure to commission me either when I'm live on YouTube or you can DM me through my public Discord server. Anyway, let me not take up your time. Enjoy the video. Oh, I don't believe I've met you before. You must be new around here. Right, you're the human that fell from Earth into Lucifer's hands now, aren't you? Well then, it's a pleasure to be meeting you. My name is Alistair. It's quite a pleasure. Yes, well, it's been quite a long time since I've seen an actual human. After all, I died a quite a long time ago. Yes, yes, well, with everything all happening right now, even the hotel staff are in quite a scuffle because of you. Yes, everyone is quite interested in you, especially Charlie and Lucifer. Mm-hmm. Yes, I did overhear something about a meeting with Heaven because of you. That would be the third one that's been happening around here. Although I would love to go up to Heaven myself because I have a few words I have to speak with them. But, after all, I am here and nowhere be able to go up there. Not without an escort of some sort. Ha <laughs> ha! Yes, it is quite tragic. But I'm not one here to complain. I'm here to help Charlie and everyone else here at the hotel. After all, I am quite the uh, host, after all. Mm-hmm. I am definitely the host of this hotel. I be helping around and making sure all the subordinates or co-workers is what Charlie tells me to call them. Just to make sure they're doing their jobs correctly. <laughs> yes, it is quite a difficult job. After all, I do all sorts of paperwork and all sorts of yelling and whatnot at our co-workers. Well, sometimes the small little egg boys, they can be quite useful, but sometimes quite ignorant. So I always have to keep them in line. <laughs> yes, I am somewhat of a um, leader in that matter. Oh, so you have heard about me. Well, I'm not really surprised. After all, my radio show is always broadcasting 24-7. Ha ha ha. Yes, I think you've overheard my radio show once or twice. After all, you've been here for quite a little bit now, ever since falling through a portal. So, I am still quite curious of how you are alive going through one of Hell's portals, or even who opened the portal, at that matter. Yes, yes, it's all so confusing. I bet it was confusing for you as well. 
but luckily you landed right into Lucifer's hands. <laughs> so, have you ever made a deal with Lucifer? No, no. Oh. He told you to wait a little bit? Ah, I see. Always being a coward that way. Hmm, I didn't say anything. <laughs> so, you haven't made any deals with anyone yet? Hmm. You know... Being down here as a regular human could be quite dangerous. After all, there are all sorts of killers, cannibals, and all sorts of very dangerous people. It would be quite useful if you had a little bit more power. Yes, yes. Well, of course he told you to be careful about making deals with everyone down here, because some of them will take your souls. And of course he told you about that. Well, in any case, how about we make a little deal, hmm? <laughs> no! Not for your soul, just a small deal, that's all. Why, for my protection, of course. Well, not my protection, but I would give you protection. Well, you see, like I said, there are quite a lot of dangerous things down here that could kill you in an instant. Including myself, if I really wanted to. <laughs> but I'm not going to do that because, well, it's been quite a long time since a human accidentally came down here. Actually, I think you're one of the first humans to be down here who are not dead. It's quite an interesting thing to be happening. Yes, yes, although it's quite, uh, sad, and, well, of course, it's going to take a while since your meeting is going to be far from now. How do I know this? Well, word gets around quite a lot around here. After all, Charlie is a bit of a blabbermouth when she gets really excited about something. And also, Lucifer is quite a babblemouth himself. <laughs> yes, he quite does talk a little too much. Even for his size, I think he would run out of air every time he speaks. Right, about the deal. So basically, I would help you if you were ever in trouble with somebody. You would just call my name and I would appear. Kind of like a uh, summon of some sort. And for exchange, well, I'm not asking for your soul. But I will be asking for mm, a little something in return. You see, with deals, you always have to give something of equal value. So, I was thinking merely just a small, tiny drop of your blood for every time you want to summon me if you are in trouble. That doesn't sound too harmful now, does it? Great! I'm glad we could be doing this business now. <laughs> so, along with this deal, you have my protection, obviously. And, with everything else in accordance, 
you would also be getting help from the people I am associated with, which that would be Charlie, Husker, Vaggy, Angel Dust, Sir Penches, and Lucifer himself. You are quite protected down here, after all. Ha 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 ha! Yes, you could say you are like an MVP of some sort down here. <laughs> ah, but of course, of course, you must be very busy with all the sorts of meetings and whatnot that you're getting headlines all over the interwebs of. Why, I did see a few of your photos going around on the colored TV shows. Yes, you are making big headlines. Human in hell. How has it happened? No one knows. But we will find out soon now, won't we? <laughs> but I'm keeping you I'm keeping you here. Come on. Get going. I know you're very busy. Ta-ta. Ha, 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 ha.